based on their numbers this year. Michael, you've just experienced ground level buzzing. Oh, absolutely. Good evening, Andrew. Yeah, uh, it feels like semi-finals have come early just down there at ground level. There is a huge uh, amount of support of Canterbury, obviously, here. I, I haven't felt this, Andrew. I've been coming to a lot of Canterbury games since I've left here. Uh, I, I haven't <laughs> felt this since <laughs> since I was playing here. The, the, the support, yeah, there he is. One of the Bulldogs' passionate supporters. But, but the, the noise and the atmosphere down on ground level was, was captivating. It's great to be part of Great to see the resurgence of the Bulldogs. The competition is better when the Bulldogs are flying, but the Cowboys come south to make a statement. Looking for a home final. And boy, uh, it, it's been a good couple of weeks for them. Uh, a really big win over the Raiders. They had the bye. And then a win last week over a depleted Melbourne Storm. But Ruben Cotter locked in. Look at the eyes on Ruben Cotter. It's ready about to get serious. Ready to play finals football just the second time in the last seven years for the Cowboys. It's a long tunnel coming out here at Canterbury. Oh, this is magic. This is magic. Final round of regular season. Drink water, one of the star performers. Let's watch and listen to this reception. Haven't played finals footy since 2016 and now they're a week away from the business end of the season with a spot all locked look at up this, look at this who let the dogs out here they come in front of a big big home crowd I haven't felt that for a while. Yeah, Stephen Crichton. Uh, boy, do they knew him back. Disappointing loss last week without their captain. Comes back into his side. Coach said during the, the pre-game warm-up, talking to me that he had a real chip on his shoulder this week. Disappointed he wasn't put there to help his side in their loss to the Seagulls. And that's what they've brought him for. They've brought him for what's turned around at the club uh, throughout the regular season. But they have bought Stephen Crichton for this time of year. His leadership. The coach said it's gone to another level. And Stephen Crichton back into the blue and white tonight. This is big. Greg Sutton is referee. Greg Atkins is in the bunker. Everyone's under a little bit of pressure tonight. Enjoy it right here on Fox Lee. Hutchison to King for the first count. Hutchison back in the first grade this week. No burden. Cowboys, don't look away, Clifford. Oh, and hey, Clifford was he might smashed. Be in some trouble by here. Kick out. He's got straight back to his feet. To Clifford's credit, Billy Army kick out has cleaned up Jake Clifford, who luckily has bounced back to his feet. Dragons bound. First kick of the night, and first points of the night. Lucky wondering what's doing. I'm here on the left wing. Let me at them. Cowboys back to centre field. Griffin Neiman. He's only seven from the line. They'll do well to hang on here, Canterbury. Slow to play the ball down. Robson, Clifford, Drinkwater. Hands by Leah. Felt really is in. Felt's corner. And the experienced winger just plucks it out of the air. Sexton down that side of the field. And they had numbers. Two of Canterbury players on the outside. They couldn't get the ball there. He streaked up field. It was a great chase from Tracy. Reeled him in quickly. And kick out trying to slow down the play. Lucky not to be a set restart. They come out to their right edge where they have been brilliant. And Kyle Felt finds his 21st try of the season. 21 tries for Kyle Felt for the Cowboys this season. Shrugs off Tracy. And the Cowboys through Drinkwater and Violia. Find Kyle Felt and the experienced winger in his famous corner. Gets the Cowboys first tonight. He's coming the way. Oh, got it in 20 minutes. Detention. Holmes to keep the run going. Valentine Holmes. <laughs> you would have him kicking for your life at the moment. Now a big chisel and Noon comes through. The Cowboys left side did it. Great ball. The Cowboys on fire here. Back 
again through the middle. They just blew the ruck apart and then down the short side, just getting outside of Morant was dead and beautifully done. That isolated Sexton with Lukey, who is so big and athletic. I said it earlier, that the Cowboys are to go deep into the finals. You feel like they've got another couple of gears with these back rowers, and you've got to put them in the right position. In fact, there was Steve Crichton, who he blasted through on the inside shoulder of. Crichton was rocking out, worrying about Valentine Holmes and the speed of Holmes on the outside. And Lukey straightened, and Peyton loves it. Oh, yeah. We'll show you the build-up again in a moment as Holmes looks to keep this going. Take it up to 20. Yes, it did. Oh, wow. <laughs> Splits the post. They can. 108 on the clock. Full set. Cowboys. Canterbury just have to find a way here. Neal on the first one. He's been superb off the bench. 11 hit-ups for Griffin Neal. Clifford. Dearden. Nene. Blink and you miss it. Superb from the Cowboys. Brilliant. Drinkwater puts the ball into row 75. The Cowboys, all the wagons are here tonight. The wheels are locked in. Linking up with his halves partner, Clifford the Deer, and back inside off Nene. That is brilliant. Just challenging Billy Army Kickow, who is gasping for air here at a core stadium. Holmes to finish the first half. Kick on its way. My goodness. <laughs> This is as good as you will see from a goal kicker. Freakish. What a run, 21 in a row, and the majority from out wide. Half time, Cowboys 20, Bulldogs nil. The Cowboys now up within 10 of halfway, and they're speeding it up here. And now on the run, Dearden. Here he goes again. Heal him, Loki. Look at these long legs into the 20. He's had instant impact. Finn Fuliaki waits for his first football tonight. That's handy. In and there. Oh, Loki again. Loki! What a game he's having. With 25 minutes to go. Dean and quickly along. It's a three on two. Quick hands. Felt for 150. Felt is good. Yeah, again, it comes off a line break from Loki, who's having a night out. Great catch and pass under pressure there from Tommy Dearden. Clifford did well. And boy, what smarts from Kyle felt is just straighten off that right foot on the inside there of Clark. Tracy coming across in cover, but it's the footwork here. Bang from Kyle felt one of the great finishes in our game. And 150 tries. Boy, what an achievement for him. 30 points against a depleted storm. You thought they just well, they have to get their defense right, or, or they'll just fall out of the finals. 24-0. Uh, Valentine home, oh. not quite as straight down the middle, but it counts as another one. Here's Robson. Infield, drink water. They rushed up on him. Comes out the other side. Way to home. He's going to chip chase. No, a little low kick. Holmes will get the bounce. Oh, Valentine. Valentine Holmes. Here's the pressure coming out hard from the inside. Haywood misses. Preston's out on his feet. And Holmes doesn't hesitate. Beautiful kick. And just too much acceleration, too much skill. And in way too good a form, Valentine Holmes. Loves the big time of year. Loves the big occasion. And slices on the outside of Connor Tracy. And the Bulldogs have conceded 30 in back-to-back -back weeks. After having the best defense in the competition, they have conceded 30 points in back-to-back -back weeks leading into the finals. This man, and the meter is ticking, 14 for the night. He should make it 16 for the night, which will take him to 60 points in the last three weeks yeah. to storm home to claim the honor of leading point scorer. Here it is, Valentine Holmes. And he's done it again. Yeah. He's done it again. This scoreline is incredible. Canterbury with Sexton. A bomb to the corner. No, not to the corner. And bounces up off drink water. It's a mess. Sexton comes up with it. Sexton. Down a narrow short side. Lofts it into the air. Competes on his own kick. Gets there we're against drink water. Ball goes back. Kyler unable to hang on to the footy. And straight back into the arms of Toby Sexton. 
you see, McIntyre, he lets go of the ball. Fyler can't hold on to it. Toby Sexton there, claimed the four-pointer. Hasn't got one for the Bulldogs. But he's got one now. 32 play six, 17 minutes to go. Like that, between them, we've got uh, 33 hit-ups for the bench forwards of the Cowboys as they attack. So it's very flat there. That was forward to Felt. Yeah, that was forward. He went from flat to forward very quickly. <laughs> Middle. Scrum line. Okay, we're here, boys. Scrum, scrum. Another shot clock here. Yeah, down the short side, Clifford Scrum. just trying to unlock some space for Nene. Sure you the pass just pulled forward only fractionally, but right call, touch judge right in line with it. Officials have been good tonight. Only six penalties for the game, it's been great. I hope that remains. You, you just get the players dictating the outcome. What an outcome this is for the Cowboys, though, to, to walk away tonight knowing home final. Yeah, preparation starts back to Townsville well, conditions all the rest James but. Hooper saying that they've spent $60,000 as a club to get them back on a flight straight after this game a chartered flight back home to Townsville to start their preparation for next week the humidity is a massive factor at this time of year in the heat in Townsville he's on the run there so Cowboys fans get excited from far and wide your team Throw intercept. It's on again. Tell Lungy he's got a big gap on them. He can shut it down now. And he does. And plunges over to score. The Cowboys, I can say, suppose they're bringing it home. Good form. They're bringing home to the finals. 36 to 6. It's Connor Tracy as they venture on a long shift to the right hand side. Look at this. He's, he's got ahead of the line, gets into the passing lane, and shows great acceleration to go away from Sexton. The effort from Hayes on the inside is brilliant. Brilliant from, from Harry Hayes. But Taolungi just drops it back into second and coasts his way to the northern end of Acor and a Bulldog side. Now 36 points. The defensive resolve, the blue and white ball. The last two weeks, 34 points to Manly. 36 now with a kick to come. And the Cowboys accelerating towards a home final. And it has been a demolition job. I wonder if they've been won 10 of 14 against the Bulldogs in recent times. And Holmes He's just got another. Drives another three He's got pass. another one. The Cowboys with Deedon, Setterfield for Taumalolo. Harrison Edwards has gone into a dummy half roll here for the Cowboys. Reese Robson off for the night. Uh, there is Clifford, and now Dearden floats it across. Holmes, it was asking for the intercept. Holmes jumps Ooh, in the air. It's his wrist or thumb, or is it shoulder for Karaz? Shoulder. Oh no, Jacob Karaz. It was an awkward collision with Valentine Holmes. We'll have a look at the replay in a moment, but he's clutching a left shoulder. Dramas for Karaz. My goodness, drink water. They're coming his way. Down, down. Fini Fuiaki. Just caught by Hayes. Five away. Last tackle. Out it goes. Telugi over. The one up Karaz wasn't going to stop it. The Cowboys are into the 40, and it may not stop there. Their right edge has been. His attacking numbers continue to climb, and it's Taolungi who goes bang, bang, two tries in a matter of minutes. Second try. 24 in the row, it comes. 42 to 6. Holmes again. Valentine Holmes. Well, the commentator can't pull him up, so that's how good he's kicking. Last play of the game. Marnie is with it. Gives it to Preston. Siren sounds. Ball comes loose. The Cowboys complete an absolute demolition job at a core stadium. They came with all their tools tonight. And they have done a hell of a job. A statement made a week out from the finals kicking off. On a night where Felt reaches 150 career tries as well. What a scoreline. The Cowboys 44, the Bulldog 6.